the AI showdown, outmatching AlphaGo variants at every turn. Want to learn how to outsmart AI? Then stay tuned until the end of the video to know how. Humans are destined to do greater things. We have a lot of capabilities and quirks that enable us to do things that animals and other organisms can't. We are also very ambitious, seeing how we have done so many things that seem impossible at first glance. The pyramids of Egypt, tall skyscrapers, huge monasteries, architectural marvels, and so many other things that are bigger than life. One important factor that enabled us to create such things is the advancement of technology. These advancements have also helped us in a lot of projects. The rise of different machines and tools has helped us to optimize our work. And with the digital age on the rise, there are more physical and digital tools than ever. We now have robots, computers, and especially artificial intelligence. AI has played a massive role in the advancements of society, with how much it has optimized and automated many of our processes. Not only that, but it has become more widespread than ever before. Even some people who aren't very knowledgeable on the tech scene know about AI, and it really says a lot about its impact on society. There are a lot of common AI programs out there, such as Apple's AI assistants Siri and Alexa, chatbots in online shops, and of course, ChatGPT. AI develops at a rapid pace due to how quickly it can process and adapt to various information and experiences. This is so it can optimize tasks better, which results to better outputs for the users. Arguably, it's already on the same level as humans when it comes to specific tasks, if not nearly on the same level. But did you know that AI still has a lot of limitations and vulnerabilities? There are still a lot of aspects where humans are better than AI, which is one of the main topics that we'll be discussing in this video. Hello there fellow AI enthusiasts! Welcome to the amazing AI channel where we talk about artificial intelligence and all things related to it. Today we're embarking on a unique journey, not to marvel at neural network based AI systems, but to discover how we can outsmart them. AI might be very advanced right now, but it still has a lot of gaps in its arsenal. Certain functions and niche situations still exist where some tools or programs are way better to use, and sometimes humans can still do a better job than them. And we're not using brute force. We're using cunning tactics alongside tools that can help us go against them. We humans may not be digital, but we still have a lot in the tank. If AI can adapt, then so can we. So let's get into it. In order for us to provide you with more AI content that interests you, please make sure to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell. Now let's dive into the fascinating world of adversarial attacks. These are tactics that can exploit the vulnerabilities of AI systems. And trust me, many modern AIs are more vulnerable than you'd think. There are actually a lot of these in common AI programs, and most of them haven't really been patched up yet. It can be because the processor has a set limit to how it can process things, or any other factors that the developers might yet to implement or change. Let's begin with the you shall not pass game. Imagine a game where a red agent tries to block a blue character from crossing a line. Regular AIs battle it out. Sometimes red wins, sometimes blue. But here's where the magic happens. The adversarial agent appears to do nothing, yet it reprograms its opponent to act almost randomly. It's AI trickery at its finest. It's really unpredictable, and at the same time, it shows the tricks that AI simply can't overcome. It sure is something that goes against AI's seemingly flawless systems and processing. Next, we have the horse to frog pixel trick. In another case, an AI was tricked into seeing a horse in an image, but by changing just one pixel, it suddenly saw a frog. It's not about randomly changing pixels. It's about strategically reprogramming the AI's perception. You might have already seen this image in the past considering how this was an infamous illusion. It can actually seem tricky to both humans and AI alike, considering that the way the image was created is intended to confuse the viewer with the use of different lines and angles to produce different visuals. If you look at it from different angles, it's either a horse or a frog. And if you add an entire pixel at a certain spot, it could transform into a specific image. At least this one is something that is just as challenging to us humans. Those illusions and tricks were challenging to deal with. But now let's go to the next one with AI's ostrich transformation. Picture this, a bus image, some noise, and when combined, the AI doesn't see a bus and noise, it sees an ostrich. That's the power of a well-crafted adversarial attack. It can be easily fooled. These illusions that we craft can also trick them into seeing and processing certain things. A lot of machines and tools can exploit this weakness when used properly. So what do you think of these AI tricks so far? They can be pretty interesting, especially with how they can actually one-up AI in their own game. We would love to hear your thoughts about this, so feel free to leave a comment below. 
Now back to the video. New AI challenges current AI, which not only improves it, but also enables consistent AI flaws to be explored. Now, we're delving into new research. What's remarkable is that these attacks aren't flukes. They systematically exploit weaknesses in other neural network-based systems. They're not just beating AI, they're doing it consistently. These new AI are setting the standards for the next generation. It might seem alarming at first, but this is a step in improving their systems. Now we'll talk about the Katago takeover. Hold on tight because this attack defeated Katago, an AI that's arguably stronger than Alpha Zero and AlphaGo Zero, renowned for defeating top human players. This adversary was self-trained with no human knowledge, a monumental feat. And just to further emphasize the strength of Alpha Zero and AlphaGo Zero, these AI defeated actual Go World champions. These aren't just random players, these are masters who have devoted most of their lives to playing this game. For them to be beaten by this AI is very impressive. It also speaks volumes about how good Katago is. And for it to be beaten by these attacks is also astounding in its own right. With these attacks comes adversarial art, the best in fooling image recognition. And there's more. When noise is added to an image, it slowly transforms into something entirely different. But the AI insists at seeing the original image. It's not just limited to paintings, this works across various examples. Acknowledging AI's limits is a step in improving and regulating them. You can't have everything after all. These examples reveal the limitations of modern AI systems and in what aspects they can improve upon. While they're powerful tools, they have their weaknesses too. Sometimes, these limitations aren't immediately apparent, and that's where more research comes in. And with more tests and experiences, these limits can always be continuously broken. Exploring AI's hidden flaws is not something that should be avoided and it's something that we must continue to do as we progress further in this age of AI. In conclusion, we've uncovered some of the vulnerabilities in today's AI systems and how they can be resolved in some way. It's a thrilling field with powerful tools, yet it also reminds us that even the most advanced technology has its limits. Thank you for joining us, and stay curious, fellow scholars. Until next time. As always, your support means the world to us. Here at Amazing AI, we always make sure to provide you with news and other updates in relation to this field of knowledge. If you want to stay tuned to what the Amazing AI channel has yet to offer, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you in the next video.